What it is guys, my name is Swifters, and today I'm going to be bringing you guys some awesome information regarding the PC version of Grand Theft Auto V. Nonetheless, for those of you who do go on to enjoy today's video, all I ask is that you'd slap that like button and subscribe to my channel for some more awesome GTA V content. With that said, let's get started. Alright guys, now as you have been seeing on screen for quite some time, these are some brand new screenshots from the official PC version of GTA V. So guys, Rockstar actually posted an article on their newswire regarding all of these images along with some new information about the GTA 5 PC version, so I will have a link to that article down in the description of today's video if you'd like to confirm the information that I am supplying you. Now I'm going to go ahead and read you a brief section of the article and it says, Today we've got an all new set of high resolution screenshots for you for the forthcoming PC version of GTA 5. Arriving on April 14th, GTA 5 for PC is fully optimized to support all of the latest and greatest hardware with an abundance of PC specific enhancements. Look for the official GTA 5 PC trailer next week and also if you plan on getting the digital download version, make sure to pre-order by next week, Tuesday, March 31st to get an additional $1.5 million of in-game bonus money to spend. So guys, that's about it for the article, but as you guys just heard, the official GTA 5 PC trailer will be coming next week, and I'm super excited for it. I can't wait to see what other things will be incorporated into GTA 5 Online as of the PC release date. On top of that, for those of you who are planning on getting GTA 5 for the PC, I highly recommend pre-ordering it because if you do, you get an additional $1.5 million of in-game cash. So guys, let me know down in the comment section below if 1. you're excited for the GTA 5 PC version and 2. if you plan on getting GTA 5 for the PC, let me know down in the comment section below. In all honesty, I wasn't really planning on getting GTA 5 for the PC because 1. I'm not too good at PC games and 2. I have a MacBook Pro and it's really laggy and it's really hard to run games on it, so I may invest in getting a new computer for GTA 5 for the PC, but I'm not too sure yet. Let me know all your thoughts about that down in the comment section below, but other than that, that's all I do have in today's GTA 5 video, I hope you did enjoy it, and if you did, be sure to leave a like and subscribe for some more awesome GTA 5 content, including tips, tricks, glitches, news, and more. I'll catch you guys in the next GTA 5 online video, and until next time guys, this has been Swifters, I'm out. Peace.